Hey, I'm Lisa for WTF Lisa Tarot, and I get messages through songs, and apparently it's classic rock sun Saturday. I started to say Sunday and sin Sinday, S-I-N-D-A-Y. That's not a day of the week, even though that's every day of the week. I'm going to finish my intro, and then we'll just continue. <laughs> oh, I love tarot because it's weird, but at the same time, I'm like, it's so weird. <laughs> Anyway, I got a one ear butt in and one ear butt out. Like, share, subscribe, and follow. Drop a tip, cash app, W Tip Lisa Tarot. Check my stores, W Tip Lisa eBay, and W Tip Lisa Tarot at Dutch.com. I have Aerosmith living on the edge. And it's so funny because the other day I was listening to some people talk about shows they worked in the past. And someone was talking about Aerosmith, and they said there were a couple nights where Steven Tyler came on so wasted he couldn't even sing. And I'm getting living on the edge. I started to say Sunday. <clears throat> There's it's Saturday already. It's Festivus. It's the day before Christmas Eve. People are extra and things. I just don't see everything going well. Now a lot of people will have a good night tonight and they're gonna be fine. This reading ain't for them. Yeah, we're living on the edge. Yeah, I got living on the edge. Aerosmith. It sure ain't no surprise. And then he says that. Some people, it's their last holiday. They won't make it till Christmas, and they got two days until Christmas Day. But tonight is when they bite it. Maybe some tomorrow. Living on the edge. Do I like getting these readings? No, but apparently that it has to be said. There's something wrong with the world today. The light bulb is getting dim, and we know that people are dumber. There's meltdown in the skies. They're slaves to their phone, and you can argue. You can judge a wise man by the color of his skin. Then, Mister, you're better than man, a better man than I. Racism's out of hand. We all know that. That's been happening for a long time. Makes no fucking sense. Uh, when I'm saying people are getting dumber, I can just tell you, being in public, I have watched people walk into walls and traffic just staring at their phone, laughing. They're sitting there looking at a meme and they kill themselves. And a lot of case, I haven't seen anyone die from it yet. But it's like almost, and it's freaking me out because it's like, oh my God, it's a matter of time. About to sit you, you know, stuff like that. That it's like, please cross the street and then look at the meme. Please. Because I can't tell you how many times I've almost had heart attacks where I've been just like, if Chicken Little tells you that the sky is falling, even if it wasn't, would still come crawling back in. Where I've been far away enough to where I can't stop them, <laughs> but I can see what's happening. And they're about to walk into traffic, and there's this, or I do see them hit a wall, and then they're walking away with a bloody nose, and I'm like, oh my god. And it's just that same vibe. Now, that's a small example compared to, like, what I am seeing. What's going to happen is a bigger example of that. It's like you, energy is you could have warned somebody. It was obvious what would happen if they continued on a path, but they're like, no, I got this. They're either just uh, under drugs and alcohol so not thinking clearly or they have scrambled eggs for brains uh or they are already a little bit mentally slow and then the combination with drugs and alcohol not great some people are under spill work but it's their own spill work they did to themselves it's backfire and i can't even go online now social media i have to avoid twitter i'm picking up some people backfire bad and I, every time i open it as they're saying, th I just pick up the worst. I, it's horrifying. So I, I'm off for a bit. I can't. Again and look. Uh, people who do the same thing over and over, expecting different results, and they just make it worse and worse. And that's the vibe. There's something right with the world today, but everybody knows it's wrong. Lovers, six of swords, ten of swords. Some of you are about to get bad news. Why? Because after this weekend, some people are gone. And it just went... I wish you could hear it. The song went dead as the sound of wind. And then bomb, bomb, bomb the drums. And then he's like, I'm living on the edge, everybody. Nine of Cups. The good times are over. I do have a Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, an Aquarius, two of Cups. They're slated. Wheel of Fortune for uh to go. Seven of Cups. So that resonates for somebody. I do get heavy Virgo energy for that King of Coins. Uh, who does that resonate for? A Virgo and an Aquarius. Who does this resonate for? Someone specific. It's a femme. These people did you dirty. Uh, water sign. 
Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, two of your karmics. Like Virgo and an Aquarius are about to buy that. We'll get a couple tea on them. And then I'm going to ask for a couple more because there's so many energies. You can't help yourself from falling is what they're saying. You can't help yourself at all. Living on the edge. Humpty Dumpty sat on a wall. Humpty Dumpty had a great fall. Scrambled eggs for brains. About to be eaten by what? Great Danes. Jezebel fell out a window and was eaten by dogs before her execution. That's kind of the similar vibe here, but it'll unfold in different ways. Drunk driving, incidences, gunshots, domestic disturbances, planes, trains, automobiles, gunshots, weather. Uh, karma is here, baby. Whether you believe in it or not, I don't care. It doesn't matter if you believe in it. It's still happening. These are, could be gang sucker type people in your business, freaky shit, narcs and flying monkeys, money on their mind. Well, this fell because there's not going to be any money if you did. I think they ran out of money a long time ago. It's like defunded vibes. <clears throat> and now they're being uh, fired is the vibe. In the spiritual way, you know, it's not, I don't know how to explain it. Bunch of mean bitches got to go. Third party. So to me, it's narcs and flying monkeys uh, being washed away. In that case, da, da, da. remember the people's court? Da, 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 da. That was an 80s thing. And I honestly, I remember it more. Like, I remember it a little bit, the theme music, but I remember it more through references of movies. <laughs> like Rain Man, where he talks about it. And then, um, I can't remember what else. That's what this feels like to me. This reading is like the people's karma court. Next case. Who's the next people biting it this weekend? Because there's so many different energies. It's like overwhelming. I have the greatest by Sia. Uh oh, running out of breath, but I, uh oh. I got stamp. Do you? I don't think you can run with this full will of fortune. And I'm reading it backwards. The world, a will of fortune and full internet vibes. Uh, again, more Aquarius earth energy, but this would be a queen of coins Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo online catfish vibes or someone six of cups with a sketchy internet trail and page of wands. This woman is a karmic femme with this page of wands, empress, two of cups, judgment. Her entire internet history is under speculation. Three of swords, hangman, and death. I think after she passes away, her phone is looked over by authorities and three of coins. It's a Virgo femme. So I guess I can get in the Virgo death readings. Any men, women associated with her magician, two of wands, and her crazy bullshit uh, page of coins, ace of wands, will be facing three of wands, justice, legal consequences, and surprise, motherfucker, five of swords. That's good to complicate everything in their life five of cups if they are in prison for dealing with this woman or if their significant others find out or they find out not only was this person dealing with this person but this person gave them stds like it illness death vibes five of cups there is telling me illness and horrifying death all around this case Someone did witchcraft and jealousy. Sometimes witchcraft is actual witchcraft and love spells. Sometimes witchcraft is just lying and manipulation and catfish. It depends on the case. I don't have a catfish card. I don't have a lying card. But I'll get energy sometimes in the karma readings. Because not everyone who plays with witchcraft is doing it badly. Or, you know, that you guys are not in this reading. People who do it correctly are not who I'm talking about. These are the ones who do not. I dodge I got stamina, but don't you don't. Ghost missing in action. A lot of people are dead. Somebody was robbing people left and right and fucking up. Unlucky. And uh, with this leveling up truth unveiled, it's all about to come down. It's like a Dateline episode in the future. Virgo fam at the center of a Dateline episode. Who is the main person waiting for you to come down? I got stamina. The person who's sitting with the popcorn waiting for you to get your ass handed to you is the one who's got stamina. You do not. You're about to burn out. Who's waiting for the Virgo to get to burn out? King of Coins. Another 
earth sign, a masculine lover that so she screwed over. It could be a Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo again, another Virgo. So this is a Virgo waiting for another Virgo to go down hardcore. Knight of Coins, too, she caused him problems. Three of Swords, it's backfire vibes. Uh, there will be a water sign, masculine. I have a page of cups that seven of coins, six of coins will all be facing legal issues, as well as a Knight of Swords, Queen of Cups, Virgo, a team of people associated with Virgo, three of coins, death are facing death and hangman jail temperance their internet histories they had a good time for a while but cherry it's death and jail for you uh so this virgo masculine has been waiting for an evil virgo to go down it's coming honey bunny i hope you get back everything you lost tenfold they can't replace what was done to you but hopefully at least something can help you know you solve some issues that this has caused or something good luck man good luck I'm going to do one more case. Threes, 33s, 300, and threes. This is going to be a long reading, but you know what? It is what it is. I have Dare You to Move by Switchfoot. Haven't heard this in a hot minute. This song came out in the early 2000s, and it was a weird one. Because it's not a romance song at all, but it was used so much because of licensing for love stories, commercials, previews of that. And he says, Welcome to the planet. Welcome to existence everyone's here do you know why i've gathered you here today because uh, <laughs> christmas is coming yes but this ain't gonna be a good christmas it's festivus today when i'm reading this so everybody's watching you now it's like a setup vibe some people invited someone just so they could like roast them is the vibe who's getting roasted by a group what a chestnuts roasting on an open fire testicle nuts roasting on an open fire dare you to move this guy three of three of cups is what i started to say <laughs> as i was pulling the three of swords king of cups cancer pisces scorpio three of swords you were being invited somewhere just to be torn the fuck down two of coins you pissed off a lot of people and they're ready to roast your ass it's your chestnuts roasting on an open fire people are over your shit and it's dumb a festivus for the rest of us and uh you are in trouble like today never happened before. Let's get some tea because I feel like a lot of people are mad at this man. It's not one person. It could be his family. He might be disinvited for Christmas or he could be, welcome to the fallout, he said in my ear. It could be, uh, I picked up on a masculine not coming for Christmas and when the family finds out they're happy, this could be connected to that. But I just feel like someone's family. Wants nothing to do with this guy. Weird uncle, weird grandpa, weird cousin, weird brother. We have let the fuck ever. The tension is here. The tension is here. If he shows up, it's going to turn into World War fucking 10. Why? I don't feel like this is a great family to begin with, but it's about to go down. Uh, vacation and hiding tears. If he shows up, fake outcast. Uh, vacation. Hiding tears, fake smiles, outcast. If he shows up, all hell is going to break loose. I get a... Uh, this with this card i don't feel like this is an upstanding person uh, who is gay i get somebody who is abusive uh maybe to other family members and that's why he's not invited but he could be one of those people that are like i'm a hardcore republican but then like td jakes type i'm a preacher but i'm actually that's the vibe i get here maybe redemption is a waste of time he said in my ear overly emotional and ass clown misogynist there we go i didn't know that was there this is a misogynistic king of cups who did so much his family is over his bullshit and they're gonna let him know if he shows up or if he doesn't show up there's a sense of relief but where are you gonna go where are you gonna go salvation is here no it's not for you king of cups you're about to have a horrible Christmas. You lied about so many things. A weirdo, sexual fantasies. Your family is tired of what you've done. Played out. Money on their mind. Freaky shit. Everything about you. Your family is over it. Everybody is. This is about to get very hard for this weird relative. Lift yourself up off the floor. I'm feeling like he's going to get his ass beat. Two balls and a baseball bat. Chestnuts roasting on an open fire. You dig? Who's going to beat his ass? Who's the main angry one in this family? If this man shows his face for Christmas, I'm going to beat his ass and that's what's going to happen. Like today never happened. I dare you to move. I dare you to show up, motherfucker. I'm here with my bat. Two balls and a baseball bat. Who's ready to beat his ass? 
ace of coins, temperance, an angry father of a Pisces or a Pisces father, or somebody who is who found out Will of Fortune about you and strength. They've got two balls and a baseball bat. Merry fucking Christmas. I have this kiss by Faith Hill, but it's more like kiss of death. Eight of Wands, the world. Someone knows what you did. Could be a king of wands, an emperor, someone's dad. Did not appreciate what you have done to your family and page of wands. They're ready with two with a baseball bat for your two balls. Magician and three of wands. All hell's breaking loose. So we have It's the way you love me. It's a feeling like this. It's centrifugal motion. It's up Faith Hill. Salvation comes up big time. Maybe he has a religious family. I don't know. But whatever it is, two balls and a baseball bat. Unstoppable. You show up to this Christmas situation, body, your ass is getting beat. And I think he's going to show up. You were thinking you'd get a kiss under the mistletoe, but it's a bat to your two balls. Because Judgment Day is here for you. That's what it is. Okay, I just did three weird <laughs> readings for this. I'm done. Three, 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 three hundred and three.